What if I told you breaking the sound barrier doesn't actually break sound? It sounds counterintuitive, right? When a jet surpasses Mach 1 around 1,225 km per hour, we hear a loud boom. That's the sonic boom. But here's the catch. That boom, it's not from the jet's engines catching up. It's a pressure wave, a shock wave caused by compressed air that can't get out of the way fast enough. And once the jet passes you, you hear nothing new after that moment. Here's why sound travels in waves. When you're slower than sound, those waves ripple out in all directions. But when you're faster, you outrun your own sound waves piling them into a cone behind you. That cone is the Mach cone, and its edge is the sonic boom you hear like a giant air whip crack. Imagine a boat creating ripples on a lake. At slow speed, ripples go everywhere. At high speed, the boat creates a sharp V-wave trailing behind. Same for jets, just in the sky. But, here's the trick. The jet is still making sound. Engines are roaring. Wings are cutting air. But the sound can't reach you, it's trapped behind that cone of shock waves. So once a jet passes you at supersonic speed, it's silent. You hear just one boom and then nothing. Because at that speed, the sound is always playing catch-up. That's the strange truth about sound and speed. Go fast enough, and silence wins.